What's good, fam? What's good? It's your boy DJ Severe, man, and we checking in with the homie this morning, Suave Calion. What's good, yes, fam? Sir. Hey, man, I'm feeling good, brother. How you? Man, I'm blessed, my brother, man. We finally, finally, man, catch up with finally. each other, you know? Finally, man. Finally, brother. Long overdue, man. I'm excited about it. Way overdue, man. And and this is you know, we 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 doing this interview, man, of course, for you know, you know who, man. Yeah, shout them, shout them out real quick for me, bro, bro. Hey, for sure, for sure. It's Swap Calion, man, and I have the privilege to be with the illest, the number one spot for the indie guys. Uh, that's the urban influencer. Hey, man, man. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate Most that. Definitely. You know what? You know what, my brother, man? I had no idea, man. And and I'm going to let you share your story, man. But I had no idea you was right here in the ATL. I didn't know that. Man, yeah, yeah. I didn't know you was here. <laughs> I didn't know you was here. Man, we could have did this in person, brother. But yeah, no, I didn't know. I, I didn't know either, man. It's a small mm. world, you know? It is, bro. You've you you you've lived here all your life? No, I'm from Savannah, Georgia. Oh, I moved okay. to Atlanta, man, almost six years ago. Yeah, Good. about six. Oh man, man, there's a lot of dope artists um in this area, man, and that's that's one reason why I moved here. I've been here for about a year and eight months. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You in the right place? Yeah, man, man. I wish I'd have came you in the right place. Twenty-seven years ago, bro. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Wow. This is the yeah. spot, man. This is the spot, man. So let, let's go ahead and get this thing crackling, man. How long? Uh, Suave, how long, brother, have you been rapping? And has it always been Christian hip hop? Is that what you call it? What, let, let, let me know, man. Man, listen, I, I literally been doing hip hop my entire life, man. Like for real. Wow. Like probably since I was maybe three or four, I've been freestyling or something like that. My older brother's about 14 years older than me. Okay. And he introduced, I, I just always looked up to him. So I started in getting a part of influencing of hip hop and, and all this stuff very young, man. And so I remember the 80s through him. So that's how far me and hip hop go back. And um, I did secular music, man, honestly, majority of my life. Um, and, and my life changed dramatically, man. Uh, my life changed. And honestly, my pen changed because of my perspective change. Do mm -hmm. I look at hip hop? Hip hop is an expression of the person. Yeah. It's what you see. It's what you go through. It's, it's you getting a chance to give the world your journey through the pen. And so my life changed. So the, the information changed. Mm. So, um, yeah, man, I've been doing gospel music, gospel hip hop music, kingdom music, whatever you want to call it, since, um, man, about 2000, oh, man, 17. 17. That sound about right. About 17, 16, 17. Yes, sir. Okay, okay. So you've been, you've been, you've been throwing down with um, Christian hip hop for about five, six years now. Yeah. Dope, yeah. dope, fam, dope, mm -hmm. fam, dope. And um, I, I noticed, man, that um, uh, of course, man, you got a you got a track, and we're playing it in the background now. Yes, sir. Now, before I get to that to that dope track, because all you all you, I love all your music, my my brother. Means a lot, sir. Thank you, man. I mean a lot. Back in twenty, it was twenty twenty your first project um concerning CHH, or was it before that? No, nah, man, I had been doing it a while. My my first project was called The Peculiar People. Oh. And uh, I'm, I'm gonna give you the dates so we, okay. can, we could be on accurately, you know what I'm saying? Okay. We did that one in, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't wanna fabricate cause I wanna okay. give God glory the right way. It was I 2019. Lost your, I lost your video, Suave. Sorry about that, man, am I back in? There you go. All right, Thank it you. was 2019. 2019, 2019, I released a project called The Peculiar People. So that means um, accurately, I dropped my first single in eight. It was either eighteen or nineteen. Then just just looking okay. at that accurately, because they was it was a little bit before. It was about a year, almost a year before the project itself dropped. So wow. um, yeah, it was wow. called the Peculiar People. Peculiar. That would be the first one. Okay. It would have been that year, and then it was followed by uh, my my sophomore project was called It Takes a Village, and and that catapulted things you know globally a whole different level, man. Um, like a big difference, wow. big difference. Okay. And then my latest project I released in February of this year, actually I released it in London. It's called the uh, the Revelation. That's why I released the uh, my my latest project, man. And, and you said you, and, yeah. you released it in London. Yes, sir, man. My, my wow. I have a tour um that's actively going on. God gave me called the Indie Major Tour. 
Right. And um, while well, I, I kicked off the tour, the first leg of the tour was actually in London, UK in February. Wow. So that, that same day I released the project, man. So I was, I was blessed to release a project while I was there, um, which was the revelation. So they was the first people to partake right there wow. in London, UK. So um, that's why I kicked it off at, man. Oh, fam, that, that is that is so dope. So borrowed time was I was peeping at that track out, man. Yeah. That that that's I got I got the date 2020. Yeah. Right? Yes, sir. Heck, man. Sick, man. Just, just, I, people, listen, people. If if you're not up on this, this, this dope artist, Suave Calion, man, please, y'all, y'all go to his social media. And follow him. Please, support, please, support please. all the CHH artists. I'm telling you, yes, sir. That's my passion is supporting the indie CHH artists. And man, you got some phenomenal, phenomenal music and ministry. That's what I'm gonna call it, bro, bro. Thanks, ministry, sir. It is, bro. bro. It definitely I mean, is that. You know what I'm saying? That what What do you feel the state of CHH is now? Man, I'm gonna be honest with you. I feel like we are in a very unique space right now mm. um we got people who are challenging the boundaries and they're challenging the boundaries without being signed to a major label they're yes. challenging the boundaries without having major cosigns and nothing like that um like i give an example uh the, the homie uh one one uh one k fuel the things he's doing right now man i'm gonna tell you the truth i have to applaud that brother yes you know what i'm saying because he's 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 his ministry in his bars too i met him and it's the sincerity in his conversation, the sincerity is in the humble and how God is moving them. Mm -hmm. But the music way that he's pushing the boundaries is next level, man. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? You know, and he's back to back with this stuff. Like he's, he's in a bag with it. And then you got you got old school cats that just, not old school, but cats who season with the bars and in their ministry, you know, like like the cow, you know what I'm saying? Like the truth. Yeah. Um, who's sure. doing some things, Bizzle. You know what I'm saying? There's some guys doing some stuff that they didn't know was possible, man. And, and honestly, the names that go on and on and on. Yeah. And at this point is a different space. You know what I mean? Uh, because you're moving, they're moving in a way that's different. You know, it's in a place that honestly is an appeal to the outside world with hip hop artists that was in secular music. They're drawn to us as opposed mm -hmm. to being the other way around. Um, it's, it's a partner of mine who has to do the track with Project Pat recently. You know what I'm yeah. saying? And, yeah. Yeah. But the the way it was done, man, the way it was done, man, was uh, honestly, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. And I, I'm, I'm going to care about saying it. My man was the illest part of that song, but right. he made Project Pat stretch. And so the way that they rocked on that song together, it opened the door for something else because it wasn't reaching. It was organic. You know, it was a way that the music could be done in a, in a different way. So and then you got folks like, I mean, listen, man, we got Kanye West with the number one gospel music in, in the country and it's consistent and now it's to the point that he even got Eminem featured on Come a on. single that's Come number on. one and, and that itself is is a big deal about our about our need you know when we right. take all this extra stuff off of this stuff what we're supposed to do is bring in the world you know our, our responsibility is outside the four walls of the of the building and, and to bring an Eminem to a to a to a track and to have him really dive into his until his in his bag and really talking about God, man. And not worried about what nobody else thinks. On, you know, he got the accolades. He's just talking about the real, about how life has been influenced. And it was a big deal to me. I really like that, man. So I mean to talk a lot about it, but man, it's, a, it's an oh, interesting no, time. Dope. And, and indie major is the mentality, man. Independent truly by, you know, God, you know, my regular man stands, but it's a major stance right now and kingdom music. And, and I, I definitely feel like, man, I'm one of the people in the forefront of that, man. Just standing Amen. in confidence in God, man, for real. Hey, man, bro, man, you know, that, that, that joint's coming up, man. Right. Um, that tour is coming up October 22nd, right yes, here sir. in the ATL, man. And I, yes, I'm going to do yes, my sir. best, man, to, to try to make it out there. I got to uh, have you there, man. Come it's on, not work far. some magic for you, brother. Uh -huh. <laughs> Work some magic for your brother, man. I need you in the building, man. I'm going to get out there for you, man. I'm going to get out yes, there sir. for you, bro, for sure, man. And, That's um, you know, we're we, we going to definitely talk in the future, man, um, about some other things that that um that, that I got going on. And, and, I, and I'm definitely going to need your help. Um, the bro man 2.0 because that that's what yes. we talked about before. Yeah, 2.0. Yeah. 2.0. And um that that's a good brother, man. He's one of the first brothers that I connected with and showed me love when I first moved out here to yes. um to um Atlanta, man. Very good guy, man. Oh, Very good guy, man. Gosh, man. Dope, mm -hmm. man. Met him through my brother Torian, man. Okay. Um, man, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've been, and that's an ill guy too. His name is Toro. 
Ooh. Toro Da Vinci. That's a good friend of his, and uh, he's my brother. And okay. He, that's a that's a sidebar, but he's a he's a he's a very dope MC as well. Christian really? hip hop. You know what I mean? Like I said, oh it's, it's a different. Oh man, I got names for it. We'll talk offline because I got some people you need to hear as well that might not necessarily be broadcast as, as big as they should be yet. Yeah. But I I know what I listen to. I know what I hear. You know what I'm saying? It's like. You know, that's one thing I really love about you. You're not waiting for somebody else to applaud people. If you hear it and it's good, you already say, okay, it's I'm good. Putting them on, and I, man. I love that about you, my brother, I'm for real. Them on, man. Yeah, for sure. You are. Yeah. You really are, man. That's what I try to do. I try to get to, you know, as many artists. Send me your music, man. Send me your music because I'm yeah. going to play it. I'm going to play it, you know, as long as it's, you know, you know, a, a, a dope um, production. Yeah, of you know course. Quality. That's the word, yes, quality. Sir. Yeah, we we gonna we gonna rock that joint. You know what I'm saying? Right there on Holy Culture Radio, baby. We're gonna bump that thing. Yes, sir. <laughs> Holy Culture, that's the Holy homies, man. Culture, For man. sure. Yes, so. Yeah, yes, sir. That's bro, the homies. Brother. Yeah, bro, bro. So so on on the um indie major tour, what artists, what artists are on there with you? Oh, oh man. So I got the Agape Music Group with me, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I love that's, them. That's, that's family. That's family right there. So they on there with me. Um, I got my brother, Grace and Mercy. Again, okay. this is a guy I need you to hear. Me and him go back, man, literally being 17 years old. So, wow, I mean, the testimony really? in our situation is different. This is a brother of mine, um, outstanding MC. Um, I have my brother, Vision, um, outstanding young talent. Um, we, we've been, I've been knowing him a long time. Um, so it's, it's a blessing to see where he is now. And God and just the you know what I'm saying the ability is is, is outstanding. Um, I have the uh, oh my God, my brother man Calvin J Ford. So we doing something J. a little different. Calvin is a, is a hybrid man. He does like like Christian R and B and Christian hip hop man. So he's oh. a, has a phenomenal sound. So it's gonna be dope to bring him to the forefront as well. Um, oh man, we make sure I'm not missing anybody on the on the ballot. Um. But yeah, man, just 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 phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal talent is 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 on there, man. So um, please, it, it's something everybody got to come see. Oh man, and my sister, man, DJ Miss Eclectic is is going to be on the ones and twos, man. Okay. We had my sister DJ Shuns all the way coming from London, man, and, and due to some things with with the uh, with the travel and standards, we're gonna have to we got to miss on this on this particular one. But uh, okay. again, God allowed me to create family even across across the water, man. So I have family in the United Kingdom, man. And she was gonna come all the way here from London just to show love and, and spin and just be here with her brother. So definitely shout out to her, man. I, I just want to let her know, man. I, I understand and she tried everything in the world yeah, to get here, sure. but we do have the phenomenal DJ Miss Eclectic on the ones and twos, man. I'm a Ooh. fan of that young lady, man. That lady is cold. She She's cold, cold, cold huh? So. She cold, man. She she yeah. won a time. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So 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 we, we very, very, very excited um to just, you know, man, just, oh, my God, to be about this, this phenomenal, phenomenal move of God, man. It ain't really nothing man. else to call it, you know? Oh, I got two more people. Six five, my brother okay. all the way from Memphis, Tennessee. Okay. Listen, that's another guy you have to know. We are brothers for real, but he's one of the illest artists I ever met, man. Wow. Uh, my brother, I'm going to tell you another name that's going to resonate a long way. My brother's name is Ben Forgiven. Okay. Um, we've been, we, we actually family, like literal family. Um, but he's one of the illest MCs I've ever met in my life. And that's not genre specific. Wow. Um, he's he's incredible. I'm serious, man. We did a song called Nobody. And 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 after that, man, like that was the first one we put out to the public. And then after okay. that, we just continue to build. Um, he actually has a project coming out around that same time called Job Season. And um, it's it's yes, man. I'm I'm glad God wow. put that in my memories. I didn't want to definitely. I can't oh, wait. I, I didn't think about my brothers, but those guys live in person is a ministry in their bars. It's a ministry and what they're doing. And they really allowed this indie major thing to be created. This is not just an incredible tour in terms of music. This is an encounter in God. And I, yes. I, that's what's so different about this is a worship. It's a, it's an, it's an excellence in the, in the performance. This mm. is something needed. You know what I mean? Amen. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Wow, I can't wait. See, you're making you making me want to go now. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> hey, I'm going to send you some stuff today. If, if they don't, I'm going to tell them to send it. I don't care about nobody please, else being fast please enough. Do. I'm going to send it to myself. I need you to hear these guys, man. I need you to hear these guys. I'm, I'm talking about it. It's some talent. Oh, my God. Yeah, next, next level guys, man. Now. Next level guys. Six five. Being forgiven. Vision. You know what I'm saying? Calvin J. Uh, the Agape Music Group. Oh, yeah. Grace and Mercy. 
You know what I'm saying? Myself, Suave Kelly Young. Yes, yes, yes sir. Man, that, what, what a great lineup, man. Yes, sir. What a great lineup of ministry, my brother. Wow. Yes, sir. Wow, yes, sir. Wow, yes, sir. Wow. The excitement Can't is on wait. a trillion, my man. Can't wait, man. Can't and wait. it's at my church. It's at my church. The oh, that's your, that's your home church. Okay. Man, listen, it's not just my home church. It's the place my life changed. It's the place Amen. my trajectory and God changed, shifted. I seen them for myself. It's, it's, it's not small. Like, we'll talk about that offline. Okay, but sure. But when I say about that, that in itself is a whole nother reason why this is gigantic. Like, that by itself is a whole nother is a whole nother level man i, I don't even want to get started in it because but, I, but I know what, but i know where you talk i know i, I can because i can feel what you're talking about and, and what i what i got from what you just said they back you man i can feel that you're, you're oh you're man church, they, they, they back you yeah brother it's 100 percent. you need that 100 percent. praise um God. but not just in the music man it's about the totality it's yeah. a totality shifting god man it's it's, it's, it's being a place where, you know, the difference between religion and relationship shifted, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, it was yes. an introduction and now that's just my, that's my responsibility, man, to be yeah. a billboard to God, like Come to be on. an introduction to I, but this is not, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I mean? Cause no, you do it, you do it, you do it every week, you do yeah. it every, every day consistently in your way that you move. Like these talents are not given to us for, you know, any man accolade, but right. it's, it's given to us, you know what I'm saying? So, kingdom you know, building. I ain't baby. gonna get started. I ain't gonna get started, bro. Oh, it's you, all you good. Feel me? <laughs> hey, you feel me though? Yes, sir. You feel kingdom me? Kingdom building, baby. Yes, sir. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Oh, that is so nice, man. Man, I got I got one more question for you. Mama. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And, um, yeah. I'm I'm not sure if you're aware of um of this movement that we that we um started up, but I I proposed a question about two and a half months ago. And so it, it turned into a hashtag. How do we reach our youth? Yes, sir. And, and I want you. I want. I want. To, want you to close this interview up with with your thoughts and your input on hashtag. How do we reach our youth? Man, listen. That that's one of the major facets of my movement. Amen. The way we do it is a transparent ministry, man. My apostle says something, man. Um, man, it was over three years ago. Might even been four years ago. But what he said is transparent. Transparent is the new parent, which means the way to really bring in the youth and it's the youth in terms of being adolescent, in terms of maturity, um, you know, what I'm saying in terms of, you know, through humanity, as well as the. Uh, the, the, the immaturity in, in God, like you may be a baby in terms of your relationship with God says both. It's two it's twofold in that regard. And the way that you really reach people is you got to reach people in the realness. Like my label is called Real Music, and, and that's the fabric of what we build. It has to be an authenticity. The way you reach people is, is universal. Real recognize real. I don't care if you're in the street. I don't care if you're in the prison. I don't care if you're in the dope game. I don't care what you're doing. The way that you really, you know, build a relationship or put yourself in a place where people can trust you or hear you is right. through realness. It's through being authentic. It's being authentic. Um, and that's the way to really truly use to reach the youth. One thing that God has truly blessed me to do, man, I, I did a show. I want to say this was either March or uh, it was April of this year. And I was in an older Christian church, older mm -hmm. traditional gospel church in a place that, of course, Christian hip hop is not normal. You know, it's, it's, it's not even used to having regular worship like how it is now, the new age worship. And yet they had me in the building and God allowed me to have people I'm talking about that six and seven years old standing up, clapping, can't sit down to people in their 60s, 70s Man. and 80s Man. who also stopping clapping and can't sit down because the music is universal what's being done that has nothing to do with just the bars or the beats which is important excellence in bars is important but what's more important is the ministries in, in the bars that's universal you see what i'm saying that's not yes. placed in a box in terms of a specific type of niche market only you know what i'm saying it's not like right. that once it's once it's digested in that ear gate it, it opens up into a person and it's something right. you can't deny is the, is the power of God. You can't, Amen. you can't put that to the side. That's, That's how we truly reach them and not being scared about where we go. You know what I'm saying? The Bible told us, Ooh. you know what I'm saying? God said to go. He said to go. And you know, he, and he said, and, and, and the conversation is clear that that go mandate is not talking about going to corners inside of four buildings. Right. Uh, in terms of the traditional building of a church. He told right. you to go to the highways, byways, the low ends, you know what I'm saying? Whatever grace, Clearly, whatever his grace gives you to go, you know what I'm saying? And just being bold in him. That's I don't right. care if it's at your job. I don't care if it's on the corner. I don't care if it's in the park. I don't care if it's in the grocery store. Wherever he has you to go and just stand on excellent in this place, going at it wholeheartedly. 
you know, and presenting God mm-hmm. in the way that he gives you to do it. And to me, that's truly, I'm, I'm sorry to talk about it, but I won't let, oh, you know, and that's important. This is how we reach the youth. We reach them where they are. You know what I'm saying? We meet you where you are. Right. And, um, and from there, we let God be God. You know what I'm saying? Our responsibility is not to do his job, but it's, it's truly just to give an introduction. It's to create a handshake. I've been in business a long work. time. Mm. It's a handshake. It's an introduction. Yeah, Once the handshake feel. takes place, the business aspects creates a win-win between both parties. This is how it exists past that point. Mm. It's, it's the handshake. So that's how we get them, man. That's how we get them, that's man. And, and that's truly my mindset, man. That we got to get them, man. It, it's, it's, a, it's a necessity. See, see, this is not it. a game. You just said it's, it. Man. It's something we have to do. We have yes, to sir. do it. That's right. We have to do it. And I think once they, because you said truth and trust, man, when once they trust us, watch out. Watch oh, out. Yeah. We're going to see it. We're going to see a shift. Oh, was, ooh, I, I can just feel it, man. Because like I said, God, too. working on some things um in my life with, as, far, as far as the youth and reaching our youth, and I'm gonna need brothers and sisters, you know, like man, I'm myself, in. man and man. I, thank you, man. Thank I'm you, in. God, because we we. I'm in. It's this is this is beautiful. necessary. It's gonna be a beautiful thing, man. It's necessary. It's necessary, man. Amen. You know, the people was overcame by the testimony, man. Yeah, like, we can't play with that. You know what I mean? That's that's why I feel like um. To me personally, the type of music we do hits so different because mm-hmm. hip hop doesn't give you a bounce in terms of the amount of stance that you have before a chorus right. or, or to have to have such a repetition, you know, in order to grab the people in. Right. We got 16 bars to just speak about, you know, whatever is influencing or, or, or the things that we're experiencing. That's a long time. You could say a lot in that time frame. Then you have a Fair chorus to, tow it, to bring it in. Then you get another 16. You know, at a minimum to do the same thing, just to Amen. just to truly speak to the heart of men. And and that and that, you know what I'm saying? We can't just negate that opportunity. Like right. God courageous this thing for a reason. You know, it's it's man. another way. It's another way. Man, thank God, man. Thank God, man, for the opportunities to minister. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. I love it. I love it, man. Yes, sir. Swab, swab uh Kelly on my brother, man. Um, uh, please share. All your social media, so, so yes, um, so people can know how to get in touch with you, know how to support you. I know you got like over ten thousand monthly listeners on Spotify, something like that. That's a beautiful yeah. thing, man. And I want to know. I want to let you know, brother, that DJ Severe has your back, my brother. I got that means your a lot back, to man. Me. Send that, that music over lot. if you need anything from me. If I can help you out, I got you back, my bro, bro. So go ahead and share share all your that social means a whole media lot to me. on how people can book you and and follow you. Absolutely. So, first of all, booking information. Um, I keep it simple. You guys can always DM me. Suave Calion is my Instagram. S U A V E C O L I O N E. Follow me now. Definitely DM. Reach out. Um, let's let's build. That's the first thing. My my uh Facebook is Suave Calion. Um, that's my artist page. So it's the same thing. First and last name in terms of how the Facebook is presented. Also, you can also reach out to me on my personal page, Saad, S-A-A-D. My last name is Morell, M-O-R-R-E-L-L. I believe they two are the same. You know, I'm I'm, I'm Clock Ken and Superman. So just, right. you're welcome to reach out to me either way. I don't believe in separation in that regard. Either way, I'm accessible. Um, Definitely reach out. When it comes to music, man, I'm on all digital platforms, all of them. Um, Suave, S-U-A-V-E, Calion, C-O-L-I-O-N-E. You can literally type my name inside Google and it'll find a method for you to get to me in terms of music consumption. You have YouTube, all type of different things, right. but I'm globally listened to as well. So you have Africa has their own digital platform. I'm on that. Korea, um, I'm different wow. parts of the world have their own digital platform. So I'm not limited. I'm, I'm, I'm accessible in that regard. Wow. And, and God's been blessing me to be consumed all over the world. Um, in terms of how my music is being consumed. So to please is is never is not a limit there. So any way you need to get to me, I'm available, including YouTube. Um, in terms of booking me, please reach out. Also, my business is Real Music LLC at gmail.com. Reach out. Um, please reach out to me. I'll be glad. And we, we're flexible, man. We we literally are available to go all over the all over the world. I'm I'm not even oh, country great. confined. Um, as long as I have the time. I'm going to make the time as long as I have enough time to, you know, get that off my job and stuff like that. I'm, I'm completely right. flexible to move as God say, as long as God say is my, is my, uh, you know, is my situation there, man. Um, as long as God say I'm, I'm available, I'm, I'm willing to move. Um, yeah, man. So reach out for features. We, we got features coming out. 
um, collaborations, festivals, ministry situations. Literally, man, I'm, I'm available for whoever you need. He's a busy I'm, man, I'm y'all. He's a busy man, hey, but man. available. <laughs> but available. Yeah. But available. Yes, sir. <laughs> but available. Yes, sir. Reach praise out. I'm, I'm God. Trying to praise stay God. Busy. Stay busy. Stay <laughs> busy. Absolutely. Yo, I want to stay yo. busy. The track in the background, man, because I don't want to forget it, man. Sitcom Love. Sitcom man. Love. Yes, sir. Real yes, quick, sir. man. The inspiration p- behind this, man. Man, yeah. Oh, yes. Hey, man, listen. When I was coming up, man, um, that was my thing, man. I, I just love sitcoms. I still love them, love them now. You know, um, Martin and Gina. Right. Lincoln single. Man, I'm talking about old school. Good times. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I love Lucy. Like, I I just really, really love sitcoms growing up. I have literally the greatest parents in the world. Clinton Owens, Barbara Owens. Like, they're the best parents that's in the world. But I'm going to be honest, when it came to the marriage situation and the love, on that level, I didn't get it. They didn't show it like that. That wasn't what we got a chance to see. Mm -hmm. So for me, I knew I had a longing for these things. I knew I wanted to be this way when I got married and the relationship. And I said, okay, Martin and Gina, I'm going to be like that when I'm grown. You know, I'm going to be like, you know what I'm saying? Sure. You know, them, them TV shows, so they make it look possible. They think it happened in 30 minutes. And you ain't like that in real life in every aspect, but it give you a place to start. So that's where I started from. And I, I definitely have wrote a song, every single album for my wife. I truly believe in kingdom marriage, man, so much. Amen. So uh, yeah. shout out my wife, Tracy Denise Morel. Everywhere I go, I'm going to shout her name out. That's right. She's the greatest thing that ever happened to me besides God. Amen. And, um, yeah. Man, my man, Lewis Dudley. I said, Lewis, man, I got a, I got a concept. Man, we ain't had a beat, nothing. I had a I had a tune. My energy made it look. That's all I had at the beginning. Wow. And, and I said, I said, what you think about this? And he was blown away. He said, man, yeah, let's work. And so a beat came, a beat came later that we felt worked perfectly. Man, I already had almost the album. The song was almost written before I had the whole, before I even had the track. Look um, at and, that. And, 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 and magic, man. And oh magic. my God, people like yourself. People like so many radio stations across the, you know what I'm saying, across the world, man, um, have, have really drawn attention to this, man. So for me to have, you know, a sign is definitely heard globally. And it's a billboard for kingdom marriage. That's all it is. Yeah, there it's, you it's go. And we, and we marriage, thank you love, for that, brother. Yes, and enjoying ourselves, man. We yes, thank sir. you for that. We thank you for, for, for great ministry music um, like that, man, because that's what it is. It's ministry for kingdom marriages, man. Yes, so thank you. Yes, so thank you. 100%. So, man, thank y'all, man. Awesome, <laughs> thank y'all. Man. Awesome, oh, my God. Man. I'm blown away by this every day, man. You understand. Every Monday, I'm literally blown away weekly. And the love you guys are showing on, on the charts, man. Every single week, I'm blown away, man. It's not one week that I see myself on there. I'm never expecting anything right you know right. what i'm saying in terms of just expecting nothing man and and to see continually moving up week over week yeah. you know starting off at literally at the bottom of the charts to be you know last week i think i was number seven man like that part is gigantic to me yeah, like you understand sure. yeah. how huge that is to me man and and um yeah i just want to definitely tell you thank you you know tell all the radio stations that report thank you so much this is gigantic man for real from the highest sense of humility thank y'all so much man it means a lot to me you're very welcome, my brother, man. And thank you for um allowing DJ Severe to um to 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 check in with you, my brother. You know, man, what I'm truly an honor to me, that, man. Thank you. And let's let's stay in touch, my brother, man. Drive That's automatic. And be safe out there, man. And God bless you. And tell your wifey hello, man. Tell the queen hello, man. I will. I will. I definitely will, man. I will. I will. Please tell the family on your side. I say hello as well, man. For Let sure. Them know you got you got some more additional family, man. Let them know, man. I don't want to be surprised, man. We, we family as well now. We'll you know what do, I'm saying? Man. Let them know. Will do, my brother. Thank you, God bless you, my man. Stay safe, all right? You too, sir. You Have too, a blessed sir. day. Man, Ladies you too as well. Ladies and gentlemen, Suave Calion. There you go, yo. God bless you. Peace. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> It's the chronicles of the vibe. Around the POF before you settle down. Best decision never make no mistakes. Just when it's size, you settle down. And it's ups and downs. Always like the nation got economics. Martin and Gina just made it look easy. On the 90s comics. 
30 minutes or less is a frustration with light atomics. Matters is all themselves like the trending topics. Instead of family fuels, it's all about a survey says like Steve Harvey. I question the optics that I'm seeking. Resolution after the commercial breaks. And happiness negotiates the term like the markets and interest rates. Real estate, she would often say, you only want what you want. My reply, babe, don't we all? So what's your point? Oh, we got well, sick on love. Made it look easy. We sick on around. love. Like George and Weezy. Got Cause sick on love. A man from above. Me sick and on you, love. we got that sick on love. Carl and Harriet stay together. Jane and Flo handle the stormy weather. Me and you, you're the hands of my glove. Baby, me and you, we got that sick on love. Sick on love. Yeah, yeah. We got that sick on love. That sitcom love. Mm-hmm. We got it, we got it, yeah. we got it, we got it. We got that sitcom hey, love. What we have is that TV love, like Lucy and Ricky Ricardo. I was once a promiscuous boy, like Nelly Furtado. A man willing to endure the hardships of the day for the promise of tomorrow. Almost a decade from the altar. Something old, something new, something borrowed. All my days is weak as free will under pressure. She's my sitcom love like Fran Drescher. This my last name is how you must address her. Question, can't you see that I'm mad about you? Like Paul Raza. I'm a night guy, she's an early riser. Her makeup the finest chocolate complex like a diver's. Growing pain like deceivers. But the burst worth the complications. Started just friends like Jennifer Anderson. Quickies on lunch breaks on Duran and Habershin. Fell for the pretty neighbor, like Sinclair Overton. Sick on love. Yeah. Made it look yeah. easy. We're moving on up, like George and Weezy. We sick on love. A match from above. Yeah. Me and you, we got that sick on love. See. Carl and yo. Harry, it stayed together. Jim and Flo handled the storm oh God, and weather. Me and you, you're the hands of my glove. And in me and you, we I got that sick on love. Carl and Jim made it look easy. Moving on up like George and Weezy, Cliff and Claire, a match from above. Me and you, we got that sitcom love. Carl and Harry, it stayed together. James and Flo handled storm and weather. Me and you, you're the hands of my glove. Baby, me and you, we got that sitcom love. Yeah, yeah. We got that sitcom love. Yeah, yeah. We got that sitcom love.
make you feel bad, right? Oh no, and I'd never want to diminish this love that we had. I would be remiss if I didn't make myself real, real clean. Unmatched is what I fall, see is what I got 
Thank you.